In Matthew 7, 13 and 14 is where you find the basic idea of straight and narrow is the way and few there be who find it. The narrow way is a difficult road to travel for those who sincerely embrace it, and there are tests that are necessary along the way to help us grow up and mature and to focus on the areas we need. The tests that we face in life, which are usually appear as random circumstances of life, but they do challenge us, reveal. They reveal where we're doing strong, where we're doing good. They also reveal where we're having trouble, where we're faltering and need to focus a little more. That's the value of being tested. It is a very valuable thing. It helps us to look inside. Paul would tell us in 2 Corinthians 13, 5 to examine ourselves. Okay, I'm going to tell you that one of the ways you examine yourselves is by looking how you respond to the circumstances of life. How do you respond to what you see on TV? That's a pretty easy one, but how do you respond to the way that people treat you, how you interact with people? When life doesn't take the turns that you plan and it throws you the curveball, how do you respond? What, what's going on inside of you? Do you cry? Do you pout? Do you think God's being mean to you? Well, what's happening there? This is the value of being tested by the circumstances of life. Now, I think book learning is wonderful. I think you need to hit the books. You need to learn a lot of stuff there. But until you get the experience, book learning is only part of the equation. That's important. I don't want to undermine that any at all. But book learning alone, that's not going to get it. You want people with experience. And testing living life gives us that experience and it gives us those insights so that we can prove ourselves, we can test ourselves, and we can bring every thought into captivity, the obedience of Christ, and we can discipline our bodies. So it's all this wonderful stuff that works together for the person who understands Christianity is not this little cakewalk. It's a discipleship on the straight and narrow. And on that straight and narrow, you're learning to present your body a living sacrifice. And the testing of circumstances tells us where we're still resisting making those sacrifices. An awesome concept. So a little bit of something to think over and to roll around in your mind. I hope you'll give this one some deep thought. And as always, have a great day.